Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. For today's video, I am so excited because we're going to Hobby Lobby to check out their spring decor. Hobby Lobby has the cutest spring decor. Well, really they have cutest all decor for any season, but especially spring decor with all the flowers and just all that stuff. I love it so much. So I'm very excited to see what they have. I have a huge spring clean and decorate with me coming up that I have to refresh my spring decor. I want to get, you know, flowers, vases, stuff like that. And then this week it is tabletop decor that's on sale at Hobby Lobby. I know they do fluctuate between wall decor and tabletop decor, you know, kind of going back and forth with 40% off of each of those categories. So this week, like I said, is tabletop decor and I'm so excited because I can get new, you know, vases for the flowers. I can get cute little knickknacks and tiny little things for my tear tray that I may bring out for this spring decorate with me. Also, fingers crossed, I actually find stuff because after this shop with me, I will post a little haul. Um, depending on how much I find, like I said, I don't know if I'm going to find anything, but it's never been an issue going to Hobby Lobby, finding stuff. I feel like I find way too much stuff. So this is going to be a shop with me, fingers crossed, a little tiny haul afterwards. So anyway, let's get right into it and let's go shopping. Okay, everyone. So I thought I would come on here and do a voiceover with you guys, just showing you what I found, what I saw, you know, what things that were cute. And yeah, so I thought I would do a voiceover, but really quick, I did want to say like, I am so sorry if this video is shaky. I tried my best to make it not super shaky. As I was editing this, I was like, oh my gosh, hopefully it's not too shaky for you guys. I kind of was messing around with my settings on my camera. And for some reason I could not, you know, stabilize the shakiness. I could not turn on, you know, shaky stabilizer anyway. So I apologize in advance. I'm sorry if this is shaky, but they had so many cute stuff for Easter. They had a whole section, honestly, of just bunnies. You guys, they had so many like aisles like this, where they had in the middle, tons of bunnies, tons of Easter stuff. They had tons of natural stuff like rattan and, you know, like the jute and the natural colors. So many pretty florals. Their spring shop is so big. Like they have a good at least five aisles of just their spring shop. So I was so excited to see this stuff. They have dish towels. They have, you know, cute little placemats and table runners. And actually this, I threw this in there. It's a coffee cup that says tiny human tamer. You guys, I kind of wish I got it because that's absolutely myself. It's tiny human tamer. I thought it was so cute, but they have a whole bunch of wood spatulas and spoons and forks. I love these. I actually got a whole pack on Amazon recently. I can link for you guys, but they're the same. It's like that really rustic wood. And I absolutely loved all of this stuff. So I was very tempted to get these spoons and spatulas and, you know, rolling pins and stuff like that. But honestly, I did not need them because I just got some from Amazon. And then this, I don't even know what it was, but I loved it. I loved how it was that bohemian style, which I love to have in my house. And then, like I said, so many utensils, spoons, spatulas, they have the Ray Dunn stuff. I actually didn't know they had Ray Dunn stuff at Hobby Lobby. So that's something new that I found out. But how cute is this little thing? So it's like a little riser. I totally saw this as a dish soap and hand soap thing by the sink. Um, so yeah, I thought that was super cool. And then they did have have everything laid out as far as their appliances go. This is new. I don't think they have done this before. So that's kind of cool how they have this on display. They had so many cute hanging planters. I loved this one. I thought this was so pretty. They had florals and I'm almost super tempted to get these little hanging flowers for Brielle's room. I feel like these would be so perfect in Brielle's room, like a little girl's room to decorate for spring. Like I was super tempted to get those. I might go back, but these are actually canisters like I got in the Target section if you guys are familiar with my channel and lots of cute canisters to put candy, cookies in, stuff like that. I thought this was cute. It just says oopsie daisy. I kind of wish I got it because it was cute. And then this bowl, this is actually similar to the bowl that I got a couple years ago from Hobby Lobby. Mine's a lot shorter, but that's a super long bowl, which is a cute centerpiece. And then this is what I was talking about is they have a lot of stuff that says spring shop, but it's not related to spring. Like it's shelving units and just wall decor that, you know, isn't really pertain to spring. It's just cute stuff. And also a lot of signs, you know, these were not spring related, but they were considered the spring shop. So they were on sale. I believe it was either 40 or 50% off. I couldn't remember, but you know, they usually have the spring shop, uh, 
clearance out and I thought these were so cute if I did not have already a whole bunch of signs like this I would like that one with the black with my whole heart for my whole life like it's so cute all this stuff is so adorable oh there you go so it's 40% off of the spring shop and this I might go back and get this it says turn a bad day into a bath day how cute would this be for a kid's bathroom like I want to put this in Brielle's bathroom because I don't know I think it's so cute. And then I thought this was adorable. This gave me like anthropology vibes. It was just a very rustic vintage tapestry. So I love that. And then speaking of anthropology vibes, here's Tatum, she's so cute. But speaking of anthropology vibes, how perfect is this? I loved this mirror, you guys. I almost wanna go back and get it. So this looks like the exact same anthropology mirror. Here's a different one, but the one before looked exactly like the anthropology mirror that I have wanted for so, so long, but I think it's almost a thousand dollars, something crazy like that. But if you wanna dupe, they have one just like it at Anthropology. Of course, it's a lot smaller. Here it is again. So, oh my gosh, you guys, seriously, so cute. So it's a spring shop. It was $3.49 and it's 40% off of that. So not a bad deal, honestly. If I had a good amount of money, I would go back and get that because I loved that. They had, you know, cute stuff for tabletop decor, like these little beads, all this little black and white neutral stuff. I love this section with the black and the white and the amber colored bases and all of that. This, I kind of wish I got, you guys. I loved this. It was kind of wrapped in jute with the greenery. I love this section as well with those gray buffalo check pillows, all of the neutral, white, clean, airy stuff that I think of when I think of spring. All of these cute little signs, like I said, I don't need any more signs or wall decor but I loved all of this stuff and I loved this you guys I'm a sucker for like the jute rattan boho look and this aisle had all of that going on I think this stuff now that we're looking at is not part of the spring stuff I just thought I would show you guys kind of the other aisles most of the spring stuff was in the beginning of the video but I couldn't help but not show you guys all this cute stuff and then these, oh my gosh, I wanted these so bad, but these were wall decor and I did not want to spend $15 each on these, but how pretty are these? Like now that I'm looking at it and I'm doing this voiceover and I'm watching it, I kind of wish I went and got them. Like I kind of wish I got them at the time. I might go back cause they're so pretty. And then over here we have the burgundies and these, I kind of wish I got these too. These were so cute. I just didn't know what I can use with them. And I already have some other bases for spring decor. And also if you guys are familiar with Hobby Lobby, I'm sure you are. They have tons of florals, flowers, stems, stuff like that. And then I was surprised they did have a lot of greenery. So they had a bunch of faux trees and stuff like that. I am, you know, kind of partial to real plants. So I didn't get any fake trees, but they were actually pretty good ones. And then, yeah, just a lot of little tiny knickknacks, vases. I loved all these colors, very earthy, very neutral. And then actually this part of the video is Michael's. So Tatum and I had a little bit of time to go to Michael's after Hobby Lobby before we had to pick up Big Girl Brielle. And this is just a lot of the greenery they had. It seemed like they were just stocking up their spring stuff, but they had really cute stuff, you guys, at Michael's as well. Tons of natural stuff. They also had a lot of greenery. These plants, I could honestly say, looked better than the Hobby Lobby plants. Their plants were on point. <laughs> Tatum's grabbing it. She's so cute. Um, their plants were great. Their decor was great. They had a lot of florals of course and then here's another little section from michael's which i love everything and i actually ended up getting this vase i love it i just saw it and i was so drawn to it the rattan i am so excited about this vase i could not help myself so i got that but I would definitely suggest checking out Michael's because they had awesome stuff. And then I will show you guys in a couple minutes the haul that I got from all the stores. All right, everyone. So we just got back from Hobby Lobby and Michael's. I actually had some time to run to Michael's before I had to get Brielle from school. So it worked out perfectly. They had such cute stuff at Michael's and Hobby Lobby as well, honestly. I did pick up one thing from Michael's, but I got a good amount of stuff from Hobby Lobby. They had such cute spring stuff. They had those cute little like the spring shop with like the cute wall decor shelves and just a lot of cool stuff they did have a ton of cute like signs and stuff like that i didn't want to get any wall decor because that wasn't on sale but everything in the spring shop was on sale so jumping right into it i will show you guys these little bunnies you guys so i am not one to decorate for spring with a whole bunch of bunnies and carrots and 
that's just not my thing um so i am very neutral i'm very not minimal but i don't like a lot of bright stuff colors i like to decorate more with like textures and just neutral stuff so these were absolutely perfect for me it's funny because i went to target and i found ones exactly like this and i went back to get them and they were totally gone so i should have grabbed them when i saw them but anyway this is what they look like you guys so 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 cute they're just little basic bohemian bunnies and i got two of them as i say they so i got this one which is sitting down and then i got this one which is standing up if you hear noise that's tatum playing with her little toy she's like ro roaming around the house while i'm doing this um but yeah i am so obsessed with these they will fit my house beyond perfect i'm very eclectic i have bohemian i have farmhouse i have industrial i have modern like i have so many different things in my house but i think these are just so cute very neutral so yeah that's just what they look like they were now i thought they were half off because i thought this was considered spring but it wasn't and i just realized that as i looked at my receipt i was wondering why my total was so high but these were not on sale in case you're wondering in case you want to go back they're not on sale this is considered easter 2022 it's not considered spring um which is it's fine they're so cute and it's worth it for me and then you can kind of like bend their ears if you wanted like one to have like a floppy ear it's so cute i love them i'm so excited like i said i'm not one to decorate with like a whole bunch of bunnies and like very flashy easter stuff but this has my name written all over it so very excited about these two i saw them at target they had ones actually i kind of like these ones better than the target ones um but yeah i cannot find those target ones anywhere so very very happy to find these the second i walked into hobby lobby i saw it kind of sitting there on a table and i was like oh my gosh i want it i want it so i got those can't remember if i told you the price they were $19.99 a little pricey for a little bunny but they're really cute and i've been looking for ones like this i thought they were $9.99 but they weren't which is okay okay and then next i got actually i haven't even unwrapped it it's this really pretty vase i love it you guys how cute is this now this is a little more farmhousey looking than i usually go for but i thought this would be so perfect to put really big beautiful flowers in for spring how cute seriously in the middle of my island just a white basic vase this was on sale so this was $17.99 but it was table decor so it was whatever half of that is I love it so much so yeah nothing too crazy just a very basic little farmhousey vase I think pretty pink flowers pale white flowers cream flowers are gonna look so pretty in this okay the next thing I got from Hobby Lobby from the spring collection whoa that was Tatum is this super cute flower market sign you guys I love it it is so pretty like I said spring collection there's a little tag so it was $29.99 with half off so it was like 15 bucks I love it I think I'm gonna put it underneath my tv stand just sitting there still deciding where I'm gonna put it just because the shape is so long and narrow I kind of see it underneath on my tv stand but i love it so cute so simple flower market love it so pretty it's just like a gray little font with this rustic little wood border i'm a sucker for those kind of signs with like the wood border and the font i love it so very excited about that and then this was not part of their spring collection but i thought it was so cute i love black i love wood and i like i'm a sucker for these like little signs so it just says come as you are with the wood and the black this was half off of $11.99, so like six bucks or so. I thought it was so cute. I love it. I don't know where I'm gonna put it. I just grabbed it. That's the thing, like sometimes I like don't grab things and then I like regret not grabbing them. So I just grabbed that, I love that. And then last but not least, I got the cutest vase. And I know I got two vases, so I'm gonna have to decide where I'm gonna put them both, but I grabbed the Hobby Lobby one first and then I saw this one at Michael's and I was like, oh my gosh, yes, this is perfect. So this, you guys, it is rattan. It is beautiful. It is so me. I absolutely love it. So this was, I don't know if it's going to focus, but it was, I believe, 40% off of this. So, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. See, it's such like a vibe with like this, the very natural stuff, the very, you know, 
bohemian stuff. I love it. I think so after looking at this one, I might put the flowers in here. Like I said, I'll kind of find spaces for both of them, but I saw this and I loved it. They had it in a shorter size too, like half of the height of it, but I liked this size just because you can put flowers in there and not worry about like cutting the stem super short and stuff like that. So that is the last thing, I think the last thing that I got from Michaels. All right, everyone. So that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all in my next video.